Good day everybody, hope you're all doing well. This is my lens collection and the only reason why I am showing you this is to brag. Such a humble guy, I know. So, uh, today I'm going to do a, a, just a regular walk with my friend, um, my childhood friend Luke, out in the, at the Royal Palace. I think it will be a nice, nice walk. Um, yeah, there isn't very much more to it. I uh, w will have a walk and uh, hopefully I have been thinking about some pictures uh, that I have that I have been wanting to take there so hopefully that can work out and today I will bring my 60 to 200 70 to 200 oh my god the 16 to 35 and a 50 millimeters but I haven't decided because this is my old one for the uh, the EF uh, mount and this gives much less vignetting than this new one, uh, the RF 50mm. So I think I will try this actually for like a, a normal um, normal lens. Because I haven't got my 24 to 105 yet. So I think that will do. And also if I want to take a portrait of uh, Luke, I think this could be a nice lens. And also of course I need to have my, my GoPro. Yeah, so I think I am about, the time is about 12, I think, so I think it's time to start to start moving. And also, the reason why I can show you all this is because I now have, have the adapter, so I can put on the wide angle. So it's a 14mm wide angle Samyang lens on right now. Um, I hope you liked the view of my little camera family that I love. So dearly. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. Mm. There's also two more coming up, but uh, I think, you know, we're such a cooperative family here, so I think they will get along really fast. Yeah. You know. to do with this picture is I want the the castle but I want something in the foreground and I think this this uh, life uh, thing uh, works as a foreground element so and I'd also try to not position it too much in the edge of the image but I want it to be you know to actually be a part of the image I also think you know this bridge and having people walking on the other side could make for quite an interesting subject I'm trying not to look at it too much or I look at them because there are people walking all the time so I'm thinking I should just wait for a nice subject like these people riding their bikes for example
Perfekt. Nu kommer jag och så sitter vi här och väntar tills det dyker upp någon färgglad jacka. Du inte med den där datormusen. Men vad fan. <laughs> jag glömde det. Ska vi åka och köpa byxor så kan vi åka förbi och hämta den sen. Jag skulle ha sagt något. Jag glömde det. Det är inte Oh, such a, an uninspiring day. We made it to this tower, which was a, a very heavy walk of probably 20 minutes, I think, yeah. Luke is nodding. <laughs> and uh, yeah, well, uh, the the light is absolutely terrible, and um, well, there's not much more to it right now. I guess we just uh, we'll just keep walking for a bit. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. <laughs> This day is as grey as my left leg is brown and I think uh, my inspiration is just uh, draining away right now but I found this bench it is over there you can barely see it but I can and I have my zoom lens so I'm going to take a very sad picture of a bench without no one sitting on it and no people around Meanwhile, Luke is planning on uh, making his way over this ice. <laughs> but that's another story. But that's what I will do now. I will zoom in probably to about 150 millimeters. I have no idea. I'm just a uh, guy guessing right now. Um, and I will take a picture of that. Maybe I will take a picture of this person in a yellow jacket playing with its dog I don't know if what gender doesn't matter um, yeah and then we'll just keep walking because this day is so dull I think dull is the right word for this day and the pictures that I had planned of that tower did not turn out the way I wanted because there was so much trees and uh, stuff in the way and also it's just everything is gray even the green is gray or brown yeah and no light no sun no texture in the sky no nothing just just utterly and plain gray and brown I don't think you can see me and that's not the most important thing right now it's never actually with these vlogs the most important thing is this sunset it is looking absolutely phenomenal and the funny thing is this is like 15 minutes walk away from my home I mean it's so close and I've been thinking for for years honestly uh, about going here and taking photos but I've never uh, made it here but now I am uh, and or I have and I'm very happy because this sunset might save the day because the pictures until now hasn't been very interesting at all but 
I, uh, not but, uh, I have a couple of compositions that I like. These towers, I'm not sure you can see them. Uh, they are from uh, some some thing close to my home. It's some kind of not industry, but I think it's never mind. I don't know what it is. I'm only guessing right now. Uh, I think they can make for a nice picture. Unfortunately, the sun has gone a bit too far, so they are very well. The sky is very dark where uh, that is. Uh, they are, and. Um, also we have this road, I'm not sure, I'm pointing, I have no idea if you can even see what I'm pointing at. But there's a road going into the eternity uh, with the very beautiful sky. So I'm thinking a long exposure could make it, uh, could make that uh, quite a nice picture. Uh, other than that, to be fair, there isn't very much more to it right now because the sun I think coming here on early morning could make some really nice pictures with the city um, towards the uh, sunrise. That would be much uh, more, uh, much more, much nicer. Um, but the sunset, though, totally worth it. So I will uh, mount my tripod and uh, start or I won't, I will put my camera on the tripod and start taking some pictures and I will show them to you because it's so dark, there's nothing to see right here, right now. So I'll show you the pictures and then I will uh, wish you a fantastic Saturday evening or whatever the day it will be when this comes up. I have no idea, but I'm very excited to uh, try these compositions out. Yes, let's do it.